and new attends some students at UCF hoping to prevent the next big, well, breach by learning how to be cyber hackers. That by knowing how thieves get in, they can better protect networks. Here's a Fox 35's Dana J. <laughs> into a network in a matter of seconds. They're on their game, basically. Log in and lock it down as fast as possible. All to defend against a hacker half a country away. Cybersecurity is a big deal. Uh, it's uh, very sexy. Uh, it's a very, very sexy, uh, nerdy technology thing. See, I just broke out of it. You missed it. Here, it's also competition. These students are part of the University of Central Florida Cyber Defense Team. Their objective? As a good guys, we need to make sure that the system gets locked down and that it's still usable while we pre prevent the bad guys from getting in. Turn on uh, your IP address is 14.250. They spend hours a week practicing hacking and being hacked. It's my form of entertainment. It's, it's really interactive. It gives me the opportunity to express myself in a geeky way, but really it allows me to learn and innovate. We're going to go ahead and make sure you secure them down. Here, hacking's a hobby, but in the real world, the ability to secure a network is talent employers are looking for. We just got hacked. Oh my God, he broke it. I assure you there's a way that me or someone else can get in, and if there hasn't, if there isn't a way I know, I can invest the time to find a way. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security sponsors cybersecurity competitions, which, by the way, this team has won, to encourage a new brand of computer specialists. You can get an IT guy, you can get a computer science guy or gal. They're going to understand how to do what they do and they can make it happen, but can they make it happen secure? All right, uh, Cody, what does Nmap do? It allows you to scan the local network. So, as they secure a network, their passion for cybersecurity may wind up securing their future, too. Dana J, Fox 35 News. I love technology.